Hello everybody and welcome back to Colart, our walking bean Sean simulator. Wow, that came out wrong. No, whatever, I like it, our walking bean simulator. Now, we are uh, currently here. I moved slightly from the church to find an actual hard save point in case it was being wee on me. Now what we need to do is find the cabin that was around here, but luckily we can teleport between camps. So let's do that. And that saves us an awful lot of walking. Yeah. Well, that was abrupt. So we are now here. So in theory, if we come out this way, head, hang right, past this washing line. This was the spooky uphill bit towards the altar, if I look. Yes, good. And we want to find the cabin, which was down this way. How to get to the cabin, I don't know. I mean, that's uh, the cabin bit's option. It isn't, because we obviously need to go in there, but that's what we need to find. And the most important thing, of course, is not to run into the angry orange Winnebago thing. What do we call it? A Wendy Bago? I forget what kind of stupid word I used for him last week. It was about a week ago, wasn't it? Do apologise the delay in sets. But, uh... It just all worked out that way this week, which is a little bit weird. Goes like that sometimes. Right, it's dark and spoopy. So, let's see if we can find our way up to the cabin. And also find the cabin. Man, I swear it was easy to find last time. Now the plus point I actually worked out is that the uh, the flashlight will give us a little bit of a flicky flicky if the uh, evil guy is nearby. Right, that's clearly not the right way. I have no idea where the cabin is. I'm gonna try this way. Oh come on, man! Give me a break. Yeah, I know it's going flicky flicky, that's not my fault. Uh oh. Oh, come on! He stopped. Now he's seen me again. Oh, he got bored. Sweet. Alright, peace, dude. Ah, there's the cabin. Alright, mystery solved. Ooh. Lettery thing. Did I not got this one before? Excerpts from about logbook entry about a Dr. Ivan Wonski. Also, I know some people tell me how to pronounce stuff. I'm still going to flub it. I'm really sorry. Do you know what we wanted to do? We play. He's nearby. I'm reading. If you eat me while I'm reading, I'm going to be very upset with you. Oh, come on, dude. Really? I'm reading. Oh, come on. You can't get me while I'm reading. That's a checkpoint. It's the universal gaming rule. I'm at the checkpoint reading the thing. You can't eat me. Or weirdly punch me. No, I don't know what letter I was reading. Now I'm gonna have to open up the menu. P, escape. J, J. Right. Alrighty. I set out the Shut up. Which one was it? Uh. Reports maybe. There we go. Do you know what we wanted to do? We played gods. Telekinesis, telepathy, group hypnosis, causing mental and physical disorders, creating disin... Disin... Dis disintegrated? Disintegrated space? Really? Are you going to do this again now? <sighs> Subjects did not even handle a sample of the radiation. The ones that somehow survived behaved as if possessed. Communi communicating with a different voice... You know what? You know what? Fuck it. I'm not going to read it. You're a jerk, and I'm not going to read your game. Suit yourself. If you can't even let me spawn at a checkpoint and read this shit, then so be it. He spawns up there, doesn't he? So, you know what? Bollocks to you. Alright. Let's get up to the cabin. That we somehow didn't... Because last time I went out there, I didn't I? Uh, did we actually ever work out how to get up this? We go up and round. I know that um, Satan likes hanging around here, doesn't he? Oh, these friggin' very hard trees I can't go through. Oh, game, you're gonna make me rage. You're gonna make me rage. Alright. Prick. This is gonna be one of them. This is gonna be one of them days. I'm just gonna sort of walk my way through this and sort of just run into him. Alright, well, let's try this again. 
that see maybe we can go this way, right? For this little pass. Oh, he's disappeared. Oh no, now we're back by the washing line, I think. Let's try this way. Yeah, this looks like power lines that will take us to the cabin. Oh, there we go. Success. What a friggin' pain in the arse. There's a knife here. Is that, is that relevant? Possibly. Mm, well. Let's go in the proper way, shall we? Bet you anything Satan's having a crafty wank in the cabin. Oh, nice. Well, this place looks nice. Oh, hey! Finally, we made it to the pass. Thank God, we made it. On our way, I felt someone was following us. I heard strange whispers around. I sometimes even caught a glimpse of a moving shadow in the trees. There were moments I could feel someone's breath upon my shoulder, but when I stopped still, hearing the snow crunching under one's boots, and turned around, there was nobody there. I had the impression this is a place of some horrid altar of madness. Nothing is as it should be, or, or it's some kind of a nightmare. And then we found the bodies. Something told me not to look, but it looked like something was sticking out, or maybe there was just some voice in my head which kept repeating, go down there, go. I can hear it clearly even now. So I went down and found the remaining four. The way they looked, what on earth could have happened to them? I'm not able to describe it in detail. Smashed skulls, twisted limbs, broken ribs, torn, cut or burnt skin. Never ever have I seen anything like this. A gruesome image of madness or some sick experiment. As if someone or something played with them and abandoned the destroyed toys in the forest. I felt madness was slowly but firmly overcoming my soul. I can see you. I know you can. What's well, rude? Am I, am I hiding there? Sweet. This is where the other guy, the ghost, hid. No? Alright. Oh, hey, Satan. You know, I think we're supposed to just hide in there and wait till he goes, probably. Because that's where they were hiding. Oh, no, we've got, no, we got the lack of textures. Alright, let's go in here, then. Wait. Is he coming? Come on, Satan, I ain't got all day. Some of us have got busy schedules to get on with. Like, mocking other games and things. Maybe Satan got bored. Satan got bored. Fair enough. I respect that. Guess it was a one-shot job. Alright, we're at the cabin. So... There's another note there. I guess that's the one we found. On, like this on the way. There's another note there. We want to head to this load of trees, I guess. Let's see if we can orient... Oh! Why am I guessing? We can orientate ourselves with the compass. That's north. Hey, Zane. Hey, you can't get me up here. Haha, <laughs> wanker. Look, you can be as upset all you like, I don't give a shit. Right, hold on a minute. Right, 
this is... that's north. So if anything, we probably want to head, well, like that way, I suppose. It's really no team. It's really hard to orientate around here. Have you ever tried it? I never really bothered myself. So we want to head north from the cabin, which is like that way, which should take us to the note we came from, which doesn't make any sense. I swear I came across that bridge and the note was over there. But that might have been this note. Or this note. It's hard to tell, isn't it? Uh, you know, if I had the powers of jump, I would... Oh, I can hear and screw up. Sorry. Tell you what, Saint, do me a favour. Do me in a sec, alright? Thanks, mate. Right, that'll take me back up to the top of the cabin, and I can just leave. Right. So, we should try heading north from the cabin, and see if that works. Right. Get the compass. The game does not want me to go this way. Alright, what about if we scoot around here? Eh, don't break your legs. Right. This is south. Which doesn't lead us anywhere. I desperately want to know what that note was. I should have really listened to the map when I picked it up. Spooky. Well, maybe we can pick up another trailer if we head this way? Oh, what am I stuck on now? Oh god, I'm completely stuck. Oh god, abort! 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 Crouch? Can I crouch? Can I get out? Yeah, I can, I can crouch get out of it. Right, good. Where does this take us? Just this rocky field. But I'm not... Oh, I see Satan over there. Good times. Um, this rocky field might be somewhere here, but I'm not entirely sure where exactly the house is marked. I'm not sure if this is here, or this is where. So I'm going to try and head north. Avoiding Satan. He's chilling out over there somewhere, which is fine by me. It's funny, because he's got, like, set places he's happy to spawn, I guess. Right. Cool. Let's avoid that. Mm. Well, if we get to another open area, we'll know roughly where to look. Oh, well, this is open-ish. I guess. About as open as one can ask for in a spooky place like this. Right. Still heading north-ish. Aha! An open clearing. With a path to the side. An open clearing with a path to the side. I mean, technically... This could be here. This could be this here. Path to the side, path forward, path to the right, maybe? Nope. Might be easier just to find the friggin' stones again and do it that way. Ah, this might be it. This looks like a split four-way. That could very well be here. Oh, one way to find out. Apparently another tip is if the compass goes crazy, and we can also see where we're going. Ah, oh, please tell me I can climb this. Oh, you're having a fucking laugh, mate. Come on. This is almost certainly the trees here. But, for some more than ludicrous reason, I cannot make it up here. So I might have to go around anyway. Oh, that's a bummer. Unless there's a slightly further up path I can take. Yeah, maybe maybe go up here and take a right. And lo, geography stopped him dead. For it was evil in this game, and geography was daring to stand against him. Blast, he said to himself. 
I wish I could climb this slightly knee-high wall. But nay, the engine won't allow it. We must proceed round and long. For this is our future. So it's the game, that's, that's lame. You, you suck. <laughs>